Alright, Jaybot back here with another review. This time it is the much sought after Universe 2.0 25th Anniversary Cyclonus and Nightstick. And I haven't got his nose out properly. Fuck this. He's in a wonderful, rich, dark purple if you can see it it's a bit dark I hold it up to the light a bit yeah you can see that let's take nightstick off for a moment he is um, a Cybertronian cruiser this is more the um, animated film version He's a bit dusty, which is not good. Um, key difference is if I show you, I've got my G1 version here. The nose cone design is if I do that. It's different. That's pointed where this this one's more of a, a needle end, which is what it was in the animated um, movie. Whether it was an animation mistake, like the one where he suddenly he become so also the space unicorn, which is interesting. It is brilliant. Quite a um, details with bits of ready brown colour and the light grey the odd bit of beige on the hinges which a lot of people was worried about this beige colour um, translucent red plastic inside for the cockpit which is really good I don't actually think he's dusty he's got retractable landing gears three of them um, only one major bad point there's not really a set um, position for the feet in this mode they, there is a lot of movement that shouldn't really be there but it doesn't really affect it and it is marvellous um, I'll just show you nightstick here's more here's uh, oops animated more like his animated version with the single big barrel that I don't think the original G1 nightstick I haven't got him unfortunately I don't think he had that bit from what I remember I could be wrong he's a lovely purple color with black arms I don't know while it's showing up actually probably not that well that's a bit better yeah you can see the, the black and he's simple to transform just Pull the feet down, push up the toes, push the gun barrel out and just move his arms and there you have the light stick in robot mode. And he's brilliant, loads of our articulation in the arms, in the legs, only at the hips unfortunately but that's alright. He's fantastic. On to the actual Cyclonus figure. Transformation is quite frankly a piece of piss put up the landing gears and what you want to do first is open the, the front like so top push in the the nose cone which on some of them like mine is a little bit bent when it comes out of the packaging there's not a lot you can do about that push the nose cone down into it's got a double hinge, push it to the front like that, I want to move the head round, Un uh, pin the shoulders, rotate, pop into place, there's two pegs at the top here, same with this one, like so, move the arms down and um, this bit I've forgotten there's the fists that's it push them down 
like so. Move the wings around and that way so that they are actually facing out. Same with this one, if I just do this quick. Yeah, with the arms, they push down and stay in there. Uh, to the side a bit and with the legs just pull down the front bit pull down the, the back bit or a sort of double joint push out the feet oh and they will get them in the right place clip together same with this one like so and there you have Cyclonius interesting enough for some reason he's only got one hole for a gun he hasn't got one that side it's just a fist but he's fantastic he's got loads of articulation in the elbows it will twist that way that way up and down but it, there's none at the wrists but I think these elbows make up for it Twist them like so. Toss at the shoulder. There's a lovely lead piping in the eyes. It's red. It's an evil stare. Lovely detail on the knee pads and this articulation at the knee, at the hip, at the lower bit of the hip. He is brilliant. I just transfer it. Transform uh, the gun back. And just pop it in the hand. Like so. And he's just absolutely brilliant. One bad dude. Uh, could be bigger. Could be bigger. But I'm not really worried about that. He is a really good figure. There is a, a Henke version, obviously. Um, the Henke Nightstick is more.